Hurricane Matthew is expected to slam Florida all day with hurricane force winds before turning to Georgia. And there are evacuations that have been underway with some interstates becoming very busy with people leaving. CBS 42 News reporter Jamie Ostroff continues our live team coverage this morning. She joins us now from St. Mary's, Georgia with new details on how the East Coast is preparing. Good morning, Jamie. Me just as we got one of those really strong gusts of wind where you got to stabilize yourself. We've been watching uh, right here on St. Mary's, Georgia, right along the coast as that American flag, you can see it there, claps in the wind. It is blowing so hard here. Uh, now, those wind gusts are going to be important to remember because just to our south, the city of Jacksonville says it's going to be closing down all of its bridges if those winds are sustained at 40 miles an hour. You are looking at video now of what is to come where we are standing. This is Hurricane Matthew tormenting the east coast of Florida to our south uh, up through Palm Beach County. That is quite a far way south. Now where we are standing right now and to our west to I-95, most people are evacuated. Everything is closed and today it's going to all be about staying off those roads. If you have not evacuated, this is where you are staying. We are live in St. Mary's, Georgia this morning. Jamie Ostroff, CBS 42 News. Thank you, Jay.